Hello, everybody, and welcome. I better turn down my audio. <laughs> That's what my audio thing looks like. All right. Okay, so every tenth level of Plants vs. Zombies will be one of these. You have all your plants scrolling by, and you'll have some zombies. I don't want to waste that. Plant that down to get rid of this guy. Don't worry about sunflower configuration, because there are no sunflowers in these. There, no point to being sunflowers. And eh, might as well put a walnut there. Use that combo. I'm confident this guy will go out to this pea shooter. Uh, protection there. I want to save my cherry bombs. But yeah, these are... No, no, just having these little mini-games, it's just fun. I enjoy it. It makes me feel good on my insides. Alright, but... Okay. Sort of like an update-ish type thingy. Uh, I did... Uh, that guy's gonna take out that. I... I did actually buy a capture card, but it turns out my software isn't good. So, well, not my software, my computer, both of them are not good. So, I actually do not have the specs to run a capture card effectively. So, it looks like I will not be able to use to record any console games. So what does this mean for the future of my channel? Well, first of all, it kind of bums me out because I won't be able to play cool things like Ape Escape, which was going to be my next thing. Uh, Kingdom Hearts, Bully, Jack, the Sly Cooper series, Legend of Zelda, uh, the Skyward Sword, Wind Waker, Twilight Princess, Assassin's Creed, Batman Arkham Asylum, Red Dead Redemption, Assassin's Creed, all of these, I wasn't even looking at the game, <laughs> all of these I had planned to do, but now I cannot do. So, I'm sorry, but we're going to be doing stupid little Steam games like this from now on. Either that or emulators. But hey, as long as I'm doing games, I feel content with that. So, yeah. Alright, I'm going to dig up a few of these walnuts here. Just because they're, like... Okay, I'm gonna let this bucket head guy go through, and after he finishes this off, and let this potato mine have some time to come to fruition. But yeah, that's unfortunate. But, what can you do? I mean, I'm not gonna buy a different computer. I like just bought my new computer and it's unfortunate it doesn't have the right specs to play uh, well to capture because I had an uh, Hopodge HD PVR I think that's how you say it Hopodge whatever why do they make their things hard to say now let's just take these guys out cherry bombs I mean I was saving them for emergencies but what emergencies am I going to have now Get, just get these out of the way. They're not going to be too helpful. I'm just clearing up room. Give myself a second line of walnuts. Whatever. Um, get rid of this walnut. I mean, this potato mine is not going to be serving me very well. Wow, that actually went off. Okay, more walnuts. Yeah, these they will get. These sections will get harder eventually. But for now, don't sweat it. Uh, saying things in weird accents, because I do that! Hmm, looks like this one's going to get a little bit of use. But yeah. That is quite unfortunate, and I was sad, but I'm not sad anymore, because I've come to deal with that. And there are plenty of things on Steam. Now that I've gotten Steam, I can get some cheap games. I, I may have to rebuy some games I already own on Steam because I think I'm pretty sure my computer here, my desktop, has the specs to actually play some good games. It just couldn't record for some reason. And now Chomper put down some more pea shooters. I want to put in a Chomper spot. All right, third row of walnuts because I have them. No, I just realized I don't have any spots for my cherry bomb. I am going to have literally every spot 
on the map build. Like, at this point, I just sit back and watch the show. Because, really, there's nothing more I can do. These chompers are even getting kind of pointless. Because pea shooters are better because they actually fire projectiles. Okay, there's going to be a huge wave of zombies. I'm just going to use my cherry bombs to take them out. Now I'm just going to let them show up first. <laughs> yeah, it's the final wave, so it doesn't really matter. Die, my zombitar! Uh, uh. Ooh, exploder achievement! Awesome! There are achievements in here like Xbox. Alright, cool! I got a, a mushroom. It, uh, name escapes me. Puff Shroom, that's it! Alright, shoot short range, bores the enemies. Okay, now this is a mushroom. Now, there is something special about mushrooms. Because they are used in night levels. Evening Thrasho, those zombies just won't let up, will they? You'll notice that fighting zombies at night is different than the day. For one, you won't get any sun falling from the sky. You can still get sun from sunflowers, though. And luckily for you, you got yourself some puff shrooms. Plant as many of those, and you'll be A-O good. Uh, that voice is not good enough. It's not fitting for him. Alright, so night levels. Okay, if you're going to a night level, make sure you have a sun-producing plant, like a sunflower. And puff shrooms. Puff shrooms are necessary for all night levels. Because they cost zero. They're terrible, terrible plants, but because they're free, you don't care that they're terrible. Uh, gonna get this... You, that's good for emergencies, and choppers. Alright, cool. Oh, we also have graves. Now you're gonna wanna plant this immediately, and you are going to be at a little disadvantage because it's gonna take a long time for one sunflower to boost 50 sun. Uh, you're gonna wanna hold on to your first puff shroom and wait for the zombie to show up. Because one puff shroom can take out one zombie. One puff shroom cannot take out two zombies. You're gonna wanna place them relatively far up. Because unlike the, unlike other plants, the puff shroom, I generally do not care where it is on the map. I do not want to have a row or column of puff shrooms. It's just pointless. Alright, that puff shroom should be able to take out that second zombie, and I'll just try and constitute some sun. Wait for the second one to show up before I put the puff shroom down. It might be a good idea, because these restore relatively quickly, to put a second one down. But I like to wait, just so I'll be prepared. Because, see, it's taking a very short time for that to recharge. Like, it's already recharged, so yeah, I can put one here. And I'll probably have another one by the time the next zombie shows up. Ah, and I even put that in the right spot. Good. Put another one here. Excellent. But yeah, that's generally how these night levels are going to go. You're going to want to set up your sunflowers. I'm going to have two rows. And use your mushrooms for early defense. Your puff shrooms. Because there are other mushrooms in the game. Oh, this is a newspaper zombie. He... Ah, I didn't look up his stats. I'll look up his stats in, for the next episode. Or, I'll look up his stats right now. The newspaper zombie takes 16 P's of damage. He changes form at 3, 6, and 8. And uh, when he loses his newspaper, he will charge at you. Uh, it's going to take more than one mushroom to defeat him. Ooh, we got money! If we get money, we can buy things. But, we are going to be needing a lot of money because things in this game are very expensive. So, yeah. Alright, gonna get some defenses for this guy. My sunflower. I don't have enough sun for the pea shooter. Alright, that should be able to take out that zombie on row one there. Uh, yes, pea shooter. That should deal with the newspaper zombie. 
Alright, and last sunflower. Cool, now we can start setting up our pea shooters and our snow peas. Uh, our, all our rolls are covered, that's good. I'm gonna save up a little bit for snow pea. There we go. Put it on a row that's not covered. Have a little more defense on row one. Yeah, it's just <laughs> riveting commentary, by the way. Wow, row three is... The artillery there is masterful, if I do say so myself. Row three, I feel like I'm done with already. Right, uh, filler. Because I got nothing better to do than to do that. Oh, yeah, uh, I haven't explained these yet. Okay, these gravestones, they serve two purposes for the zombies. A, they can spawn zombies wherever they are. And B, you cannot plant a plant on a place that already has a gravestone. And once there become more, the the gravestones will be become more of a nuisance. But we will get... Oh, hey, cool. Sunshroom. Okay, this is the sunshroom. Gives small amount at first and normal sun later. But we will play with the sunshroom in the next episode. So this is me, Thrasho2, saying be cool, save often, and don't do anything I wouldn't.